Brand new animal shelter was scheduled to open this weekend, but they're waiting for a few more amenities to come in. So after two years, the animals will finally get to move into their new home by early February. Local News 8's Caitlin Lukitas gives us a look inside the shelter before it opens. When one door closes. We have windows, we have daylight that comes in. A brand new $3 million one opens. This area will be so much easier to clean, this building so much easier to keep up and maintain than what we're dealing with right now. And so that'll give us more time to actually work with the animals themselves, work with the public more. Animal shelter director Mary Reamer says the old shelter could barely hold the 70 animals they serve each day. And this new one will give the animals more space. Look at that room they have. Take the dog pens, for example. Each dog pen is this size, but they also have this size on the other side, outside areas. So they just, the, the amenities that we're giving these animals, we're so excited for. The staff just can't wait. And by this spring, they're expecting to be able to tear down this old animal shelter here and build a dog park in its place. Initially, the shelter asked the city for $2.8 million to build, but didn't account for the utility cost. So the city set aside an extra $464,000 to help pay for this extra cost. But in the end, the animal shelter is expected to stay far under its new projected cost. Right now, the fund is in a positive position. Mm -hmm. um, we're estimating it could be between 100 and 200,000 in additional costs. The shelter says it expects the new facility will not only help improve the number of adoptions, but also the local community. I think people will be surprised. I mean, a lot of work went into making this building what it is, and I think they'll be impressed with it. In Pocatello, I'm Caitlin Lukitas. Reamer expects the new opening day will be February 7th.